one of the things that happened last year was, um, you know, we just opened our eighth grade um, this year. And so for the first time, we have a cohort of students who are taking algebra as opposed to a more traditional eighth grade math program. Um, but at the end of last year, as we um, gave them an entrance exam to make sure that they were prepared to enter algebra, um, we saw that they still had some places in their eighth grade core content um, where some areas where they were still a bit weak. Um, and it was important to us both that we gave them this opportunity to accelerate in algebra this year because we know that they're ready for it. But at the same time, we didn't want to accelerate them and have them fall behind in some areas. Um, and so in, in building on what we've learned from our spring sprint um, and seeing how effectively we could use playlists to um, focus on very specific um, core content areas. Um, we decided to try out uh, a summer math program where kids had a set of playlists um, that they needed to complete over the summer um, and that were designed to be um, extremely independent um, for the kids. And then um, the idea was that they would come back having, you know, bringing evidence of the work that they'd completed over the summer um, and um, that they would then retest um, with a different entry test to make sure that they had in fact um, made some significant growth and progress and that they were truly ready to begin algebra. Um, and it was hugely successful. So um, we got a lot of emails from kids over the summer <laughs> with some um, anxiety about, um, you know, trying to work through some of this challenging content by themselves. Um, but it was really exciting to be able to celebrate with them this fall. Um, and we had really tangible sort of like pre-post data to share with them about their growth over the summer. Um, and I think that gave them a big boost of confidence going into a harder class this year um, where they're expected to do more work more independently. I, that was so effective for some of our um, most advanced students. In some ways, it doesn't feel um, equitable that those are the students who then we gave this pilot opportunity to in the summer. Um, and so we've definitely been thinking about what it could look like to um, expand that to um, a, a broader range of our students.